I'm going to show you how to add and delete students from your Imagine Learning classroom. The first thing you'll do is log into your teacher account. You will click on students and groups on the left hand side. Go to groups. Choose the group that you will be working with. Uh, you may only have one or you may have three or four depending on how many groups of students you teach in the run of a day. Okay, you click on that. Now, if I want to delete a student, let's say that Sarah Brigman is no longer in my classroom, I need to remove her. You're going to go over here on the right hand side and click the minus sign. Are you sure you want to remove this student from the group? You're going to click on remove and it will run across the top and tell you that she has been removed from the group. Now, if I want to add a student, I'm going to click Add. Now, you can do this two ways. If the student is already in the district and you know they already have an account, you want to use the search fe feature. So I'm going to search for Brigman. You will type in their, their last name is fine and click Enter. Give it a few seconds to come up and then you will be able to choose from any students that are in the, um, the district that have the last name Brigman. And at this time, there aren't many because we're just starting to um, put the students in. Okay, I want to um, put Sarah Brigman in my class. I'm going to click on her name, click the check mark beside her name. If you're going to add more, you'll click save this little feature here, save and add more, and then click add but I'm only going to add her, so then I'm going to cho choose Add. And it tells you at the top that this student account has been updated. And here she is. She's in my classroom again. Now, if I want to add a student that is not in the district, say the student is new from Florida, they've never went, um, attended school in our district before, you're going to create use Create New Student, the link at the top, and then you're going to enter some information. So I will make up a name. I'll just make up something. Okay, the username, of course, is the first name and the last name and the password ABCD. Grade level, I'm going to choose third since that's the grade level I set up. We'll go here to this empty box. I'm going to choose the down arrow and choose enabled. This will allow them to take the reading assessment. And then I'm going to click create. Okay, pops up a window, tells me the account has been created. And when I look in my classroom, I can see now that I have uh, four, four students in my classroom. So that's how you add students and that's how you remove students from your class. Let me know if you have any questions. Thanks.